Today, we are starting our Coral Island Let's Play or playthrough. I hope you are all excited like I am because this is a phenomenal game from what I saw in the trailer. I'll make sure to link my reaction to the trailer in the top right, but let's get right into it. New game. All right, so there's already so many customization options here. Um, love. I want to be, let's see here. What can we do with this? All right, so we have the body type. We have face looks great. I like the face. The eyes are great as well. Um, hairstyles good. I like the hairstyle. I want more hairstyles, but I'm sure we'll get more as time goes on. Outfit, we're gonna go with option one. I think it looks really cute. And I think orange and blue go really well together. All right, so name is Brandon, Mr. And then farm name is Pawserve. We are done. Are you sure you want to create this character? You can change the clothes and hairstyle later. Yeah, I am so ready. Here we go. I'm so excited. I've been waiting so long to play this. Here we go, everyone. Our first farm and our first playthrough. You leave Pokyo to start a new life on Coral Island. Oh, beautiful water. <gasps> the sea turtles. This is from the trailer, isn't it? And there's me. Oh my God. Is that a chicken? Is that a chicken boat? Oh, it's so cool. Oh, who is that? Oh, and the little kid running with the dog over there. And the buildings are so beautiful. Oh, this, this whole place is so pretty. Connor. Hello, Brandon. Welcome back to Coral Island, your new home. Yes. It's been a long time, Brandon. Good to see you again. Oh, oh, they know me. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor. <laughs> I trust you had a wonderful journey with Mr. Wataro. Oh, oh, I get to pick. Yeah, it was safe and comfortable. I'm not sure what I'll do here. It's weird. It feels, it feels like I've done this before, maybe in another life. We'll, we'll go with um, it felt safe and comfortable. Great, I expect nothing less from Mr. Wataru. It's a Wat Wataru? Wataru. He's the best sailor you could ask for. Thank you, Mr. Wataru. You must be quite tired from the journey. Let's head over to your new place. Okay. Where am I going? <gasps> is this my farm? Oh my gosh, is that a cell up down there? There's like a cellar, I think, next to my house. Oh, Joko. All right, the floors are done. Dinda. Oh, Dinda is so cute. Oh my, what a coincidence. We've just finished patching things up here. Is this the new farmer? That's right, Brandon. This is Dinda and Joko. They're the local carpenters. Nice to meet you, Brandon. Nice to meet you! Hello, Brandon. It's always exciting to welcome someone new to our little island. Oh, I'm so excited! The house looks a little run down, but it's really cute, though. Indeed, Brandon. This will be a new house. It's a bit run down, but... Ahem, excuse me, Mayor Connor. Did you just say we did a poor job here? Oh? <laughs> Dinda's like, uh, say that again. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, I love her. Eh? Oh, no. I mean, yeah, Connor, what do you mean? Tell her. Go ahead. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm just joking. <laughs> I love the sense of humor in this game. Unfortunately, we can only patch up the roof so it doesn't leak and replace some of the rotten wood. Oh, boy. Okay. If you want more renovations, you can visit our shop and house in Hillside, northeast of here. Okay. We won't charge you for it, but you'll need to gather the materials yourself. Okay, I'm guessing like stone and wood or something else. Once we restore the foundation, you can decorate the house the way you like. We have placed the complete instructions in your mailbox. Well then, it's about time we head home. See you both around. Take care, Brandon, and good luck. As you can see, people are very excited that you're here. Doobly so for Sam. 
You should pay him a visit once you're more settled in. He's the owner of the general store in town. Okay. And that is the field where I'm guessing you'll spend most of your time. Oh, is this like, oh, this is my little farm area. Okay. Is that trash? What is that? I don't know what that is. <laughs> my character's like, uh-huh, uh-huh. What am I going to do here? Oh, uh, that is really big. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I love the camera zoom out so much. That was so funny. <laughs> it's a bit messy now, but I'm sure you'll take care of it in no time. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> Once you harvest your crops, you can put them... You could put them here or anywhere else you have to sell here in the shipping bin. So I'm guessing, like, it's the same as the other past, like, Harvest Moon-esque games, which is, like, this is my shipping bin, and I can put all my stuff that I want to sell for the day in here. Okay. I'll ship the content overnight to the appropriate stores in town, and you'll receive the funds the following day. Okay. Thank you for telling me, Connor. I'll be going now so you can get some rest. Oh, and since you just got here, you probably haven't bought anything you need for farming yet. That is true. You just got me off the boat. <laughs> Here's a little something from town to get you started. Okay. What are you going to give me? You got a can, an axe, a scythe, and random seeds. <gasps> Look at this little cute picture. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, the way that... I love little details like this. If you need anything else, I'm at your disposal. Thank you, Connor. Come to me with problems, questions, some mean, some mean sake. <laughs> oh, he likes a drink? Good for you. <laughs> Welcome home, Brandon. Thank you. Why, why do they keep saying that I'm, I was here before? I feel like they, he's talking to me like I've been here before. I'm confused, but I'm intrigued. New quest starting out. Plant seeds and water seeds. Okay. Oh, okay. So we move it like we move the character with A W S D. Okay. Seems like time does pass in the house too. Okay. How do I interact? Oh. Brandon, if you repair your house, you'll need to gather some materials. Please collect 50 wood and 20 stone. That should about do it. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. After you've collected everything, head over to the carpenter store, create an order at the counter so we can begin work. This job will be done same day. Yes. Okay. So we need to start getting these. Okay, so Sam is up in the top left and good thing that you just auto collect all this stuff. Okay, I am also playing on controller and keyboard. Uh, at at this current time, controller is not supported, but they do want to con include controller support. Okay, so we're getting all these. How do I do? I use a hoe? Do I use the 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 hoe? Do I use the axe? Do I do this? I do, and it's trash. Legitimate trash is in my yard. Oh, glass. Okay. Looks like that could be useful, right? Okay. So, I'm gonna just try my best. Okay. I'm gonna try my best to get what they're asking for. I really want to be able to upgrade my house first. The game seems to be pushing it a little bit, so I'm assuming I, I need to do that at, at some point. I wonder if I should just do a tree as well. Could be faster. Okay, fiber. Fiber is a thing here. Okay, good to know. Yeah, I'm so excited to play this game. I just saw the trailer pretty recently. Um, I have a video up on my YouTube about it, and it was really fun to, like, look through the video and see how the game has changed, because I haven't really, like, looked into the game in a while. It's been quite a few months, so it's been amazing to see, oh, 
the team just did such a good job at really upgrading this game and making it come to life. And there's so much more to go. Just kind of clear out a big section here as well. Okay, this one takes a while to do. I'm assuming it's because it's like a fully grown tree here. My stamina is going down quite a bit as well. Okay, okay. Oh, a chest. What does that do? Oh, I, I clicked through it too quick. To unlock it, bring it to the blacksmith. There may be some valuable items inside. Ooh. Okay. Now, is there a way I can craft things? Oh, there is. We have a makeshift sign, fences, a gate, path, a chest. Okay, maybe we shouldn't do the chest too early. Because we need to upgrade the um, farm first, right? Or the, um, we have to upgrade the house first. So let's try to, let's try to make sure that we do that first. Okay, so these like the little, the, the, the smaller trees are easier to cut down here. Oh, the water over there is so beautiful. I might also want to try to swap these around quick. Have the pickaxe and axe closer together here. Now, does this, does this consume the candid sea? Oh, no. Okay. Okay. So, it looks like I can't eat that. It almost looks like it was candy for a second. Maybe it's just me, though. Here, I'll go this way and do it. Oh, my character looks so cute. I'm very impressed. For early access, there seems to be enough customization. There is a color, a color wheel, too. Uh, all right so let's try to do a little bit of planting as well he gave me a 15 here so that's about 5 10 15 right let's try to do this i might have to go explore for forgeables too uh, looks like I'm getting a little bit low on stamina. Doesn't look like planting seeds take any energy, but I have a feeling watering is going to. <laughs> Let's see how much. Okay, three. You're starting to feel tired. Okay, the game warns you. All right, so let's go. Let's go try. I think at the beginning, uh, I am going to sell quite a bit of this stuff. I don't know if I need to keep trash or not. I'm going to just sell this for now. And then let's go out and explore a little bit. Now, is there a map I can go to? There's a quest, so it wants me to water those seeds, which I don't have enough... I don't have enough stamina yet, but we're working towards it. We need um, a little bit more stone as well. Stranger, stranger. Okay, let's go say hi to some people. Oh, okay. I should probably... Uh, I should probably take off my watering can so I don't... Accidentally pass out. Oh, who are you? Betty. How lovely to see a new face around here. Hi, Betty. You can call me Betty, dear. Hi, nice to meet you. You're the first visitor we've had in a while. After the oil spill last year, tourists hardly come here anymore. Oh, no. An oil spill? Okay. I wonder if that's in relation to the story here as well. 
I wonder if I can go into this house. Oh, cool. Whose house is this? You shouldn't go in there. You don't know whose room this is. Oh, okay. You shouldn't go in. Okay, so it looks like if you don't have friends with, um, if you're not close enough with people in this game, you can't go in their rooms. Okay. Beautiful house, though. Beautiful. Love the aesthetic in here. That's a garbage can. Looks like it's just trash. Okay. How oh, cool. I love this little, um, the sign. It's going to be very helpful for me to, to learn the game with. What's that? Oh. Oh, the music is so peaceful. Oh, look at that! Are those cat trees? Oh, that's so cute! They Do they have cats? Oh. That is adorable. Oh. Okay, someone's working on like a motorcycle or scooter or something. Okay. Beautiful, though. What a wonderful house. Okay, so this is towards the beginning of where I, I got dropped off. Oh, hi! It's Macy from the trailer! Hello to you, too! I'm Macy. Nice to meet you, Macy. Where are you visiting from? It's nice to finally have a tourist in town. That's me. <laughs> Although, I'm pretty sure um, I'm not going to be a tourist for long. I'm thinking I'm going to live here. Pretty sure you're stuck with me. <laughs> okay, who are you? Ch uh, Chan? You're the new revival, huh? Ooh, look at her. She looks gorgeous, too. I love the sides that are buzzed, too. Don't bother me and I won't bother you. Oh, no, why? I'm just being nice. Ava. Oh, nice to meet you, too. My name's Everest. Eva for short. Eva, you're beautiful. I love. I love. And that's where they were playing volleyball, too, in the trailer. I wonder if I, if they have it on the map here where I should go to. Um, I think I'll just keep exploring for now. Wow, what a gorgeous game. I can't believe it's early access too. Can you guys believe it? It's early access and it's just so pretty and large. Oh, that's someone new. Let me say hi. <gasps> Oh, look at you, Ben. Um. Oh, a neat face. Feeling really good vibes from you, mate. No, hi, Ben. It's a doggy. Bon Bon. Look at it. He's so cute. Woof woof. <laughs> oh. Oh, what's that? Oh, butter. Good kitty. Yes, you're such a good kitty. Charles. Well, hello to you. Oh. Achoo! Oh, did you just sneeze? Ugh, spring. Not the best time to move here. Uh, Charles, yes. Noah. Ooh, hi, Noah. Oh, hey, I have to say, you're not what I expected. Oh, oh, oh. The way that, like, made me think of past dates. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> oh, I see Quinn and Chloe's there. There's a salon here. Hi. So I'm trying to figure out if, okay, I want to go over here. Let me go towards the forgeables. See if I can go grab something and finish watering. Oh, who are you? <gasps> Leah, you said you were a farmer, right? Hmm, that explains the outfit. How cute. Leah, oh, you're so rude. I'm sure we'll be friends later. <laughs> oh, what's over here? Amy, good day, stranger. Oh, you just moved onto the farm? Welcome to the community. My name is Annie. Nice to meet you, Annie. Nice to meet you, Annie. Who are you? Oh, the new neighbor. It's Emily. Hi, Emily. So someone really was moving to town, huh? I couldn't believe it until I saw you myself. Um, yep. Yeah. Oh, the bird is like really, um, active. I wonder if I scared it or something. 
Area closed off for festival use only. Oh. So over here is for festivals only. Okay. <gasps> the lights are so pretty. Uh... Oh, and there's music that goes along with this too. Oh, that's so great. What? Hi. Oh. Give glass. Oh, I don't know who you are though. Yuri. Oh, Brandon, as in Brandon, Brandon? Yeah. Oh, look at your tattoos. Gorgeous. It's nice to finally meet you. Oh, you know me. Okay, hi, nice to meet you. Wow. You could just get lost here, you know? What's in here? Oh, they're still opened. Oh, look at the teddy bear over here. Aww. Oh, that's a little messy. Honestly, this is relatable. This whole room is relatable. <laughs> oh, hi, who are you? Paul, you're going to be a farmer, huh? What brings you out here then? By the way, you can call me Paul. Nice to meet you, Paul. Oh, are those pumpkins? Okay, cool. Pumpkins, huh? Oh, hi. Can I talk to you? Oh. Oh, that fla- Oh, tulips. Okay. Can I rummage through this? I can, but did it really give me anything? Can I talk with you in here? Hi. No. I can't. Uh, Dippa. Huh, Brandon? I'm Dippa. Dippa! Yes! Nice to meet you. I should probably go home soon, huh? Maybe if I make my way there. I was just trying to find something to restore my... Uh, HP. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's beautiful. I don't think I have time to explore, though. Okay. That's another bug. Oh, who are you? Waku. Brandon. Did I say it right? Yo, he's actually kind of hot. Hi. I'm Waku. It's a pleasure to meet you. Dad told me about you. He was the one that took you here on the chicken boat. It was a chicken boat! Yep, the one with the hat. <laughs> nice to meet you, Waku. He's actually really handsome. All right, if I go to the left and down, I should be able to get back home. Maybe I can get some forage bolts on the way. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a star here. I wonder if the star quality. Oh, okay. I think we go down here. Maybe not. Okay, I have to go over here. Uh-oh, I think I'm getting close to the timer. I'm not sure if you passed out or not in this game. I hope it will pass out my first day. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go down here. Oh, what's that? Oh, you can shake them. Okay, some of these are shakeable. Interesting. I am back home. Whew, that was close. Okay. Selling that. I'm gonna sell that. I don't know if we can eat the mushroom or not. I'm not sure if we can eat the mushroom or not, honestly. I am able to. Perfect. I just wanted to finish watering my crops if I could. Okay, so learning where the forageables are are going to be really, really good. Uh, harvest your first crop. Visit Sam's general store. Okay. So I, they want me to visit Sam's store. Um, I'm going to stay up a little longer. Okay, I'm going to just gather stone for the remaining part of my energy, I guess.
We're very close. Can I do one more? I am able to. Okay. Looks like that's all I can do for now, though. So we're going to go back inside. And that is officially day number one for us. There's so much to do. So much to explore. Okay, farming 10, foraging 97. Okay, so it shows me, like, how much money I made from different categories. Oh, and if I click it, it tells me how much money it sells for. Fiber, um, the little seashell thing, the violet with a star. I'm assuming that's higher quality. Tool labs 15 per. Okay. Interesting. And auto-saving, thank God. <laughs> Oh, that's really convenient. Very happy it's raining like that. Okay, so it wants me to go to the carpenter. Does it show me here? Carpenter is right here. Okay. Carpenter is pretty close. And then we're looking for, that's a cavern. That's a ranch. He'll send blacksmith. Oh, a mansion. Okay. Coral and Sandy's Beach Shack. Abandoned Villa. Oh, interesting. Oh, Sam's General Store. Okay. So we need to go to the carpenter, and then we also have to go to Sam's General Store. Okay. So I'm going to try to go explore a little bit with the forageables here. So let's try to go explore over here until 9 o'clock. And make sure we have an empty uh, slot selected so we don't waste stamina by mistake. That seems to be a barn of some sorts. Oh, that's the ranch. Okay. Ooh, the cavern. Okay, so this is a mushroom over here. Oh, is this like a place where you have offerings? What is this place? It won't budge. Okay. Huh. I guess we come back to this. And if I remember correctly, somebody told me that time is about... 20 minutes per day. Oh, oh, you're levitating. Hello. Oh, oh, you're, you're not on the branch all the way. <laughs> that was funny to see, though. Can I go this way? I am able to go this way. Cool. I can't collect that. I think so far, I would say it would be nice to see if, there, if something is a forgeable. It's a little bit more noticeable. Uh, maybe if I play this game enough, I wouldn't say that, but yeah, I think I have someone new. Okay, I think I can... Okay. This one I am able to harvest. Okay. Perfect, perfect. Anything over... Oh, I think this is uh, the mine area. Okay, this is danger too. I wonder if there's going to be combat over there. Okay, seems like I can't go that way, can I? Maybe I can like mouse over things as well to figure out what I can pick up and what I can't. I wonder if this little green flower is, if that means it will eventually turn into a forgeable. That'd be pretty nifty if that's true. Okay, so it's after 9. It is after 9, so let's go try to see the carpenter. Oh. Am I not allowed to go that way? Oh, I'm not. I'm not allowed to go that way. But I do need to go to the carpenter, so let's go over there. Interesting. They, like, blocked you off from going that way. I'm not sure why. Oh, I love that cow. It reminds me of the old Harvest Moon games. Comment below if uh, you guys have played Harvest Moon back in the past. 
I, my favorite Harvest Moon game was Harvest Moon 64. I'm very happy to start raining today. Oh, hi. I want to say hi to you. It's been a long day, huh? Mm, the day's just started so far for me, Ben. You seem a bit drained. Oh, um, thanks, Ben. No, I just started my day. Oh, when somebody tells you that you look tired and you're like, oh, thanks. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, this is pretty. Are you Joko? Wow, you're out and about. I am Joko. I think I will stay indoors today because, you know, the rain. Yeah. Yeah, you're not wrong. Dinda, hi. Is everything okay? No leaks, I hope. Oof. Oh, the sound effects are so nice in this game. Yo, that sounds really pleasant. I found some wasabi earlier. Is it even in season? Oh. Uh, okay. Carpenter. Oh, Coop level one blueprint. Oof. That takes a okay, so fiber is gonna be used here. Interesting. Shop. Oh, so you can shred it by stone? What a calendar. A small aquarium. Ooh, I'm excited for this. Also, can we just appreciate how nice this menu looks? I love this. This is so easy and nice to see. I love the art style too. Okay, let's upgrade our house. House stage one, provide decorable interior. Interior. Awesome, thank you. I'll work on it right away. Thank you, Dinda. Joko, honey, I slightly changed your plans. Brandon here, Oh, Brandon's here, and they've collected all the materials. Let's head over and repair the house. Hi, Joko. Wow, that's awesome, Brandon. Let's do it. Yay! I wonder what the first stage of my house is going to be like. It's also um, quite interesting how you don't actually spend money for this. Dinda and Joko start repairing your house. How about it? Looks and feels more comfortable, right? Now let's move your body to help me get your stuff inside, kiddo. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yay! Oh, this little this little montage of them upgrading your house. <gasps> and then talking afterwards. <laughs> oh no, that's so cute. <laughs> Oof, that old thing was really heavy. We're finished. What do you think, Brandon? Um, this is fantastic. I'm surprised that you have a TV here, but I'm assuming you guys just kind of threw it in for a bonus. How long is the warranty? <laughs> Looks brand new. Thank you. Is it? I would say we can do better. Oh, Joko. Okay. Look, no more moldy wood. True. No more moldy wood. It looks beautiful. We have replaced all of it. We also built a new foundation for the house. Yes. That means it's strong enough for more furniture now. I'm so happy. You can start decorating to make things comfier. Speaking of decorations. We have a furniture store in town. <laughs> but since there are fewer tourists, we don't stock many options anymore. No one's buying, you know. Check it out, though. You might see something you like. If you want, we can go there right now. Oh my gosh. All right, that's enough. You'll scare the kid. Dinda, thank you. Joko, I like you, but, like, let me have, like, a few days here. Let me get some money first. <laughs> oh, sorry, Brendan. I got too excited that you really did. But it's okay. You Like, times are tight. I get it. We love that store. Even got some of our cousins helping out there. It's a family business for us. 
Feel free to visit when you have time, Brandon. Thank you, Dinda. It's in the middle of the town. It shouldn't be hard to find. Okay. Well, I feel like everything is hard to find right now because I'm very new. <laughs> but thank you. All right. That's all for... Honey, aren't you forgetting something? Oh, yeah. The TV. <laughs> We threw in a free TV for you, Brandon, free of charge. Okay, that explains it, because I'm like, I just gave you guys stone and wood, so what? <laughs> it's old and bulky, but it still works perfectly. Mm-hmm. It gets a good amount of channels, too, like this weather. Oh. <laughs> she had to hit it. She had to hit the TV. Well, sometimes you got to smack it at a 60 degree angle like this. <laughs> I love this humor so much. Well, sometimes you got to smack it at a 60 degree angle like this. <laughs> oh, the humor in this game is so good. I love it. The channels are very useful. Like the weather report on the weather channel. So you can skip watering the crops on rainy days to go fishing or something. I don't know what you like to do, but you get the idea. I do. There's a variety of shows too. Okay. Some shows have useful tips if you pay close attention. I guess that's it for now. See you around, Brandon. Thank you, Dinda. Thank you, Joko. See you, Brandon. Bye, Joko. Don't forget about the furniture store, all right? Yeah, don't worry. I, I love furniture. I'm going to help you guys out, too. Your house just got bigger. Yay. Uh, how to be a farmer. How to be a farmer with Jeff Smith. <laughs> My name is Jeff Smith, and I know a thing or two about farming. I was raised in a farm, so I got some tips for you. Sprouts. Oh, so you call me a sprout. All right, let me tell you about them. I'm gonna tell you first about my pop told me when I planted my first corn in 19LXI. <laughs> Water your crops every day. That's it. You get that down, chances are you'll be okay, Sprouts. Okay. Okay, oh, she's gorgeous. Hi. Unreasonable downpour is expected tomorrow. Oh, okay, a lot of... A lot of rain. So we're going to the quest, and I think we're we can claim the reward now, right? Awesome! Oh, cool! So it shows you like all your all your quests at once, the main quest, the side quests, and then completed. That's so cool. Okay, okay. Well, we need to go to Sam's General Store still. So let's go over there. First, we can probably sell while we're here, though, right? I'm, I'm just gonna sell these for now. I also would like to go to the blacksmith if we can do that as well. Um, blacksmith is there. Where is the... Oh, okay. Sam's General Store is here. And then if I go to the left and up, I can go to the blacksmith. Got it. Learning a new map is so scary, but also extremely fun. Even though I feel like I'm a little bit lost and I'm not sure where anything is. It's been fun exploring. Um, where's the, the store? Okay, we're getting close. Can I go straight through? Ooh, I see some forgeables here. Hi! Sunny, the new farmer! <laughs> welcome, welcome. Hi, thank you. Aw. Sunny was so welcoming. Hey, Brandon. I knew you'd eventually make your way here. Yes, Connor. I was a little busy the first day, but I'm here the second day. I wanted to personally introduce you to the owner of the store. Okay. This is Sam. He's been running this establishment for a while now. Hello, Brandon. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi, Sam. You look so spiffy with that bow tie. What a charming man. Oof. Can I romance you? <laughs> Welcome to the general store. You'll find most of your farming needs here. 
Most of the seeds I sell are seasonal, though. It would do you good to keep this in mind. Okay. If you need help, just holler. I'll be by the cat's register. Okay. Well, isn't this nice, Sam? You might finally put a dent in that seed stock of yours now. Oh, okay. He, he, he was not amused by that. Anyway, before you get going, Brandon, the moving in was quite unexpected. I'm sure a lot of people are anxious, while more, like, curious to see who the new farmer is. Why don't you go and introduce yourself to the folks in the town? Yeah, I've been starting to, Connor. People have been so nice, other than Leah has been a little bit rude, but it's okay. I'm sure we'll become besties. <laughs> Meet townies. Okay, I still have some more to go. Who are you? Oh, Eva, I do know you. Be careful out there. The path might be slippery. Understood. <gasps> Lily! Oh, a hacker? Oh, are you... Do you hack? Are you, like, a, a, a programmer or something? Um, yes. Oh, okay. Uh, shop. Daisies, turnips, potatoes, carrots, cauliflower. Oh, they sell this stuff here, too. Hmm, I have 529 gold. I think I'm going to... Let's focus on something that I can get some... Okay, let's do potatoes. Let's do some potatoes. Maybe some carrots as well to see how they do. And then some cauliflower. Um, we'll do another potato. We'll just use everything. And then I'm wondering how much is the bag? 500. Oh, I do want that eventually. So much warmer here during the rain than inside my caravan. Oh, are you like a hippie? You, I don't know. You're, 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 you're kind of cute though. I have a feeling I'm going to say this a lot. There's a lot of people in this game that are either really cute or really handsome and or really sexy. <laughs> All right, we need to go to the blacksmith. Well, let's go this way. Socket and pain. I read that as socket and pain for a second. I'm like, um, I'm sorry. What do you do here? <laughs> Ooh, pretty. An aquarium is here. Oh, 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 robots. Oh, who are you? Sura? Oh, you're Brandon. I've heard about you from my uncle Joko, the carpenter. Yo, he is so hot, actually. Hello? Wait, can I romance you too? Tall mustache? No. Actually, I also just moved here last winter for work. Nice. Good to meet you. He seems like a high-tech person. I wonder if he... Is he washing his hands? Oh, he's washing his hands. Oh, that's so cute. I love seeing the villagers, like, just existing. You know what I mean? Just, like, doing random things. Living. <laughs> Sometimes in these kind of games, you'll just see people walk place to place and not do anything. For the community upgrade, I think it's important to start where we'll have the most impact. This means building a community garden. All right, so let's go to the blacksmith. Oh, who are you? Oh, Derek, hi. Hello there, don't mind us. We'll be in and out of here in no time. Derek, can I date you? Oh. Derek. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, oh, the blacksmith, here we go. Okay. Ooh, pretty sign. Love how all the, the, the tools are just set out there. <gasps> Who are you? Rough. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> I love the scruff. Oh, hi there. Hi. My name is Raphael. Um, I'm one of the blacksmiths here in Scarlet Town. You're adorable. Hi. You must be Brandon, right? Oh, Pablo? Ooh. I mean, you're really hot, too, but I kind of 
Raphael over there is... Mm. Damn, I wasn't expecting you to look like this. <gasps> Wait, is he flirting with me? Pablo, wait, I can change my mind. How are you? <laughs> You're surprisingly cute. Ah! You don't even know me. Well, I don't have any money for any of that, but it's nice to know you can buy some of this. Um, how do I... Process a geode or coffer. Yes. You you have... Oh, I don't have enough money? No. Well, it's nice to finally meet you. Your name's Pablo. I don't know jack about farming, but hey. If you need help with tools, come to my shop just north of town. And I'll see what I can do. Ciao. Ooh. He's so handsome. Okay, so for the upgrading, we need... Bronze bars and wood. Okay. Well, it looks like I can't open the coffer because I spent too much money on seeds. I'm gonna go work. I'm gonna work t back toward. Oh, mushrooms good. Mushrooms good. I'm gonna work back towards my farm. Yeah, let's go back home. Let's go back home because we have a lot of things to plant now. Oh, this music is so pretty. Oh, daffodil. Okay, I can pick that up too. Good to know. Oh, I could go in here. I don't think we've been in here yet. Ooh, surf's up, right? Ooh, okay. Yo, this is so pretty. I love the color palette in here. The light uh, walls with the light floors. Beautiful, beautiful in here. Let's go over here. So I want to know, how am I supposed to get... Oh, inventory is full. Okay, let's go back home. All right, so this is a coral end. Actually, let's go past the coral end, and then we'll be back at home. And it looks like the, the insects are running away from me. I wonder if that means I can catch them. Right, I think I did see that. I, I think I saw that, right, on the trailer. All right, what's in here? Okay. Hi. Suki. Are those scratch marks? Thank you. Thank you for showing scratch marks in a game like this. This is so relatable. Thank you. I really, truly love seeing this. She's so pretty. I also love the purple tints with her blonde hair. Oh, Suki. Oh, hey. It's nice to see you again. It's nice to see you. It'd be nice to have more farmers here. Being able to get local produce would be a game changer. You got it. I'm here. Hi, Alice. Is is that you, Brandon? Wow, I almost didn't recognize you in that getup. Oh, so you're the one moving into the lot, huh? That would explain the outfit. Wait, Alice, do you know me? Right, it's not just a town, you know. The inn isn't as busy as it used to be. Hopefully with you moving in, it's a sign of something good. Yeah! I, I feel like they know me. Some of these characters are... Some of these characters are talking to me like they know me. Also, this whole town looks so well off. Do you know what I mean? Like, all this interior looks so expensive. And then you have my house. My house is, um, is not. <laughs> let's, let's say it's just, it's just not. <laughs> Before I go to bed, I want to try to grab that daffodil as well, if I can. Mm, okay, we'll see. I'm going to have to clear some of this out. Another coffer. Alright, we're just trying to clear a little path here so I can come in and out of this at will. And 
And I'll come down here to grab all this eventually. Uh, the beginning of Harvest Moon kind of games are so rough when it comes to inventory. After we buy the inventory upgrade, it's going to be so much easier just to collect all this stuff. All right, so let's make some holes here. Inventory's full. I wonder why I keep saying that. Maybe I'm trying to collect something as I'm um, hoeing the ground. Okay, so let's do cauliflowers. Then we'll do the carrots all in one row. And then we'll do all the potatoes here. Okay, perfect. Oh, that's why. Okay. Okay, that explains a lot. All right, and then let's try... I'm going to try to clear a little better of a path here. All right, well, the trash is down here. Okay, anyone else? That was really satisfying to hear. <laughs> I don't know why, but it was just so satisfying to hear. And then let's do some wood chopping as well. Okay, so you can hold this button and it just automatically chops for you. Okay, cool. I was able to make this chest. Um, let's start, let's start putting some stuff in here. Okay. So we're gonna save the fiber. Trash, which I'm not sure if I will be using it a lot, a lot or not. I'm gonna just keep everything in here just in case. You know what I mean? You can never be too safe. We'll try to keep everything like more typical up on top here. So like wood or stone, stuff like that. Oh, you can eat this. It's candid tree seeds. See, I thought this meant, like, actual seeds to plant. I didn't know it was that. Yeah, let's just keep on clearing out some of this before we have to go to bed. We want to be able to clean, uh, to clear out a nice path going down here. We can, we could technically get back home pretty easily, but, yeah, I want to just make sure it's more cleared out here. Oh, coal. Okay. That's probably going to be very useful. Are you all like this too? So, in, in these kind of games, I really like to make sure I use, like, all my stamina that I can. Just because I feel like I'm not really utilizing um, <laughs> all my time efficiently if I don't. Ooh, I have to be very careful, though, because the time... The time is getting very close. Okay. Let's get back home real quick. Put this in the storage and then go to sleep. Okay. That was a decent day. We, we got a little bit more done that day. Yeah, let's go to bed. Level up. Foraging. Plus one skill points. Max three energy. New craftables. Candid tree seeds. I wonder if that's just three seeds together. All right, so for farming, wild seeds. Interesting. So these count as... I guess that makes sense. It is seeds. <laughs> uh, and forageables. Ooh, okay. So morsels are decent per moral. Let's get a mushroom, right? Interesting. Looks like wasabi is the highest seller. Okay. Game save. Let's do it. Day number three. Okay, so where is my crafting? Okay, so we need sap and any tree seed. 
Oh, that's good. Okay. And this restores about, I think, 70, right? That's cool. All right. I'm not complaining. <laughs> oh, we have mail. Hello, Brandon. Looking for a way to pass the time? Or maybe you want to earn some extra corn while waiting for your crops to grow. Say no more. Come pay Eleanor and I a visit at the beach shack. We have the perfect welcome welcoming gifts for you. Okay. New item alert. Int introducing basic bag. It has a total of 20 compartments. That is a whole five extra compartments than basic tool belts. <laughs> right, carry more. Do more. Worry less. Thank you, Sam. Okay, so, um, we, we can't harvest anything yet. Let's go pay a visit to, um, the shack, the beach shack. I like how I clean out an entire row leading down to the, the next area of town, and I'm not using it. <laughs> I am such a himbo. <laughs> Okay. Well, we got here. <laughs> it's not about it's not about the destination, right? It's about the journey. <laughs> Gotta rummage through the trash, cause you know me. When we uh when we're starting out on these games, we need every little bit of coin that we can get our hands on. Who are you? Water Oh, I know you. Are you looking for some farming advice? Never worked the land myself. I'm more at home at sea. Except for my plants here, my lovelies. Aw. All right, let's go to the, the beach shack, which is... That's Coral Inn. Okay, it's over here. A little far away, but it's okay. Oh, I never got this tulip last night before I went to bed. Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, what's that? Oh, those shells. Oh. Wow, there's a lot of new forgeables here. Oh, that, is that the oil spill? Oh, no. So that's what's happening. Okay. There's so many. Am I going to have enough room? Ooh, I might not have enough room. I have to go back. I'm probably going to have to go back home <laughs> before I accept the gifts. <laughs> probably should have thought about that before doing all this, huh? All right. So I'm going to go back home, sell all of these, and then start fishing. See how fishing is. I like coming here just to think about things. The ocean clears my head. Yeah. Don't you just love this sea salt scent? Ha! That's funny to say. Sea salt scent. Um, it's a little bit stressful for me. I'm not sure about you guys, but... <laughs> Alright, so let's go back. Okay, the farm. Oh, right. It's showing me my farm is here. <laughs> oh, man. I was like, wait, farm? Who lives here? Oh, wait, I live here. <laughs> oh. It's hard to be me sometimes. It's hard to be me. <laughs> All right, and we, I guess we'll sell the fiber. Fiber seems pretty easy to get. And then I think if we just go to the left here, we go left and then we go down. Okay. Nope, that's not left, that's right. Oh, I am such a himbo. I mean right. I go right, and then I go down. <laughs> oh, hi. Charles has to take his antihistamine. I don't know what else to tell him. It will literally make him feel better. Oh, he's not like doing that? Spring literally just arrived, and it feels like Charles has spent hours sneezing his nose off. I have to admit, I worry about them. Honestly, me too. I have a lot of allergies. And I feel like they're always more common at nighttime. I'm always super stuffy at night, and I don't know why. Does anyone else know? Let me know if anyone knows, like, why it seems like allergies and being stuffy happens more often at night. Very interested in that. Okay, so we're going to the left here. Oh, 
Eleanor, hi. What? Sunny, we can't do that to the new farmer. Poor thing will get overwhelmed if we give both things at once. <laughs> okay, then we start with fishing. Oh, okay. Who doesn't like fishing? I love fishing. <clears throat> Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad, bad idea to... <laughs> Hi! Welcome, a new face at last. Brandon, is it? Yes. Jim! Brandon is here! Oh, who's Jim? Nice to meet ya. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, Jim. Nice to finally meet you, Brandon. Come have a seat. We were just discussing your wholesome gifts. Oh, welcome gifts. <laughs> wholesome gifts. <laughs> it's fine if you prefer to stand. You gotta keep those leg muscles strong, eh? Yes. Yeah, yes, I do, Sunny. Good one. Speaking of leg muscles, I have the perfect workout for you. Catching bugs! Yay! Sit, sit, Brandon. Okay, okay. Oh, we can actually sit! So, how's farm life? Um, uh, nothing I can't handle. That's the spirit. Resilient youngster. Remind me a lot of myself. <laughs> Settle a debate for us, Brandon. Which is a better activity? Fishing or fun and ever-exciting bug catching? <laughs> My wife, the competitive ladybug. <laughs> Size. <laughs> I like both. Really? It explains why you moved to the farm, actually. <laughs> I do like I do like farming. Well, in any case, here's a welcome gift for you. A fishing rod and a bug net. You can sell your catch or donate it to the museum. Looks like they're going to need it. Oh, okay. We have a museum too. Good luck. Thank you, Eleanor. Thank you, Sunny. Eva, hi. It's nice and warm here. Hmm. What do you think would be the perfect bait good for spring? For me, probably something colorful, like a fruit tart. So yum. <laughs> oh, it's Sam! Hi, Sam! Still got a, a lot of errands to run, huh, Brandon? Yeah, I do. Sam, I'll talk to you again. The tavern is one of the oldest buildings on this island, aside from the mansion, that is. It's been refurbished many times, so you probably can't tell. Yeah, I can't really tell. You're right. I could buy, like, uh, stamina and food and stuff. Okay, so when I get some money coming in, I can start buying some of this. Oh, a net for catching bugs. This one's a solid choice for a hobbyist. And the fishing rod. Used to catch fish. Great for the casual angler. Okay. Let's do some fishing, shall we? Let's get in some fishing. And let's see how this works. Wait for a fish to hook the line. Okay. How long does this take? <laughs> uh, do I have to go find shadows of a fish or something? Or... I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be fishing here. Maybe I'm not supposed to be fishing here. Huh, I'm not sure where to go to fish. Maybe I just I was just wasn't patient enough. We can try again. And I would I would like to try to fish too. Oof, that's a lot of oil. Probably wouldn't be good to fish there. Alright, let's just try this again. Wait for a fish to hook the line. Okay. Oh, okay. So I didn't wait long enough. Oh, so you just hold it? Okay. I caught trash. I caught myself. <laughs> okay, that's nice. It's not like Stardew Valley or something. You just 
all you have to do is hold the button. You just hold the left click. That's nice and easy. Although, it seems like fish are a little bit scarce. I'm not sure how much time I should really invest into uh, fishing. Especially because it seems like I caught, after all that time, I only caught trash. So, hmm. I kind of want to see if I can catch a bug as well. We'll go up there. I think over top right, there are some bugs and stuff. So, let's go back over there. For lease. Oh, interesting. Furniture's there. I'm too poor for that at the moment. Hi. Oh, I'm sorry. Some animals only come out when it rains. Have you noticed that too? Yes. Psst. What? I'm trying to capture footage. Will you keep your voice down, please? Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, the game just called me out. Emma, so the rumors were true after all. Welcome to town. Is that a taco? Is that a taco on a little scooter? That is so cute, Emma. We got a new scientist in town last month, too. Can't remember his name, though. Anyway, I hope you like it here. I like it so far. Sure, sure. It's nice to meet you, too. My name is Emma. Oh. <laughs> She's like, yeah, that's nice. Bye. <laughs> All right. So we're looking for... Oh, that was a frog. Oh. I got it! We got our first bug! A true nomad, nomad carrying his home on his back. That's so cute! I have it. I feel like back in the day we used to be able to catch bugs. Oh, is that a moth? I think it is. I feel like it's gonna be a while. Wait, hello? No! It flew away! It got spooked! No! I am messing up. I caught, like, the first thing, and then I'm messing up all these other ones. <laughs> it's hard. I think I got this one. <gasps> I missed it! No! Aww. It was so, it was, oh, what's that? Wait, can I not catch you? Oh. Sorry. Oh no. The way that I was trying to catch something that's not even an insect. <laughs> that is embarrassing. <laughs> uh, just trash, okay. I don't think I visited here yet. Is it open still? Oh, it's it's a school. Look how pretty this is. I love the rainbow uh, feet prints. I'm loving the rainbow flag here. I'm loving, oh, they have all the colors here. Be creative, yes. Hopscotch. Oh, the music's so cute too. No! It got spooked! Oh, can I get you? Oh! I got him! Yay! A moth! A moth with a pair of eyes on its back. Ooh, looks creepy, but really cool though. What's this? Is it supposed to look like that? It looks incomplete. Oh. Maybe it's part of the story. Oh, there's a hottie over there. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go we have we have to go back home soon. Let's go this way. 
There seems to be a stranger over here, and I don't know who they are. Either they're running away from me, or... <laughs> Where are you? Oh, you are running away from me. No, come back. I want to say hi, whoever you are. I cannot catch up to you. Are you going... Oh, there you are. Hi. Jack. Oh, you are huge. Hi, Jack. Just call me Jack. I run the local ranch. Oh, are you a rancher? Oh, Jack. Your lot has plenty of space to raise livestock. Once you're settled, maybe we can discuss raising animals. Okay. Yeah, Jack. Oh, right. That's the ranch up there. And this is back home, right? Yes, it's back home. Okay. We got to know more people today. That was good. So let's sell some of this stuff. I should probably save some of this, but... I am just trying to make some money. And before it's too late, let's use up some of, some of our stamina. Then we can put all this in our chest over there. Awesome. We'll just do some more wood. Oh, actually, you know what we should do? We should put this stuff in a chest before it's too late. It is getting quite late. I'll put the seeds over here. All right, another successful day. How much money did we make here? Foraging. Oof, that's a lot of forage. That's a lot of foraging. And then catching. So crickets were 25, and then the moth was 30, and the snail was 20. Okay. Interesting. All right, everyone, that is the end of episode one of our Coral Island playthrough. I will probably release one to two episodes per week progressing through the game. I hope you all enjoyed it. I know I did. It was super fun to figure out like how to fish, how to catch bugs, um, even seeing the upgrading of the house, it was so cute seeing them have, like, a cute little animation where we were, like, out, the character was helping them put together um, the house and uh, then talking on the floor on the carpet. It was just cute and wholesome. But, uh, but yeah, if you liked the video, make sure you like it. And if you don't mind, consider subscribing if you like my content. I'm just starting off on YouTube, and I have been overwhelmed with all the support that you all have been giving me. Every single comment, every single like, really, really brings me joy. Thank you so much. I will see you all in the next video. Have a good day, everyone.